This is your host, Naomi. When people think of carnivores, they tend to think of animals, despite the fact that some plants, such as the pitcher plant, also consume animals. But at City Brewery, that biogas is captured, cleaned, and burned in an engine called a Yenbacher that creates 3 million kilowatt hours a year of electricity, all of which goes onto the grid. To offset that amount of energy from a coal-fired plant, you'd have to remove 395 cars from the road or plant 490 acres of forest. Whoa. Panama Canal is in its early stages of a 5.25 billion expansion that should double the amount of goods that pass through it each year. The century-old canal uses locks to raise ships 85 feet above sea level. Water from a man-made lake is fed by gravity into the logs, causing the ships to rise. Ships then pass through artificial lakes and channels and exits through locks on the other side. The Santa Claus we see today, with his jolly belly, white beard, and sleigh, has actually been inspired by many great people in our history, the most popular being Saint Nicholas. A nobleman born in the Greece, Nicholas was born to wealthy parents in the village of Patara. After his parents died, he decided to sell what he owned, give the money to the poor, and devote his life to God. Lynn Sanity, College Years Lynn worked hard, balancing basketball, studies, and a girlfriend. He once forgot Valentine's Day and baked chicken for dinner to make up for it. Above Waves is awesome. This guy calls his device a flyboard. The water comes from a jet ski and then goes through a hose to a platform he controls with his feet. He added the hand jets for better stability, kind of like Iron Man. He's hoping to start selling these things later this year, but this was just a one-man demonstration. So if anyone lined up to give it a try, well, they got hosed.